Hey, up viewers and viewers, my name is General Red Stratist, and welcome back to Wolfenstein 2, uh, the New Colossus, Episode 9. We're here in Mesquite, in Texas. We are about, I'm presuming, to have a bit of a family reunion. I'm not sure who to expect here. Am I to expect the nice, kind old mother, or the dad who's a bit of a racist asshole? We will see. But without further ado, we're going to get straight back into it. Now, there seems to be a f couple of markers on the screen. There's one over there, there's one by the barn... So, maybe we have to sort of search around a bit. Maybe find things. It looks like it's seen better days, this place, not going to lie. Has it been abandoned for quite a while? We had a scene, of course, with um, Blazkowicz and the little girl in the uh, previous episode. Fishing for tadpoles and all that. Over here. Oh, wow, look at this place, though. Oh, can I get out the water, please? There we go. <laughs> Took me a moment, but I got there. Alright, let's have a look at the barn. See what the old deal is. Open the stable door. It's a stable. Whoa! Look at this, Billy! Look at the rat fell in the mop bucket now and can't get out! Look at that! He <laughs> drowned! Probably. Well, save him, Billy! He's drowning! It's just a rat. He's gross. He's eating our food and spreading germs, pooping in our cupboards. Well, he's dying! He's dying, Billy! Yeah, do that. <laughs> He's dead. Too late. He's dead! <laughs> Billy, look! Billy! Come back! <laughs> you didn't do did it, Billy. You saved his life. Guy. How old was I then? Nineteen, twenty, maybe. I was nine, maybe ten. So I guess we're going to get flashbacks. So we probably want to go to that one next before we go anywhere else. I see. Oh boy. Yes, yeah, drowning traps to get your rats and mice and all that. Cool. But um, if you live on a farm, and <laughs> sometimes you kind of do have to take out the uh, pests at times. But if you're going to take them out, let's preferably do it in a quick way. <laughs> All right, here we go. Frank's letter uh, rip. What in the hell are you doing? I told you many, many times that there'd be consequences if you didn't get your business together. Your fiscal ailments are just spiralling out of control. Now, I've been a friend of yours for a damn long time. I've stood up for you more times than I can count off the top of my head. And I believed you when you repeatedly told me you would sort your act out that you'd get the business floating above the red line again. Now, did you deliver? Hell no, buddy. You just squandered away every last bit of opportunity I gave you. That's why I'm bringing the death knell for this friendship. Goodbye and never speak to me again, Frank. Hmm, interesting. So, is Rip Blazkowicz's father, maybe? Hmm, because if so, that maybe explains things, or maybe gives a few hints about his character, that maybe he is the way he is because of trouble in life. Starcard, who we got? Uh, 690, Ruby Webber. Hmm, there we are. Nice. Lovely. Also, I've got to remember, I can actually manually save the game any time. I don't have to wait till uh, you know, checkpoints come up. Right, what do we got? Uh, Washington urges cooperation with Liberator squads. That's a very euphemistic way of putting it. <laughs> euphemistic? Is that the right word? No, that's, uh, I don't know. It's a very, how should I say, Orwellian way of putting it. That might be a better word. December 23rd, 1948, Los Angeles. Little more than days have passed since the devastating bomb hit the heart of New York, prompting the total surrender of the United States of America to the forces of the German army. The German troops have descended upon Washington. They're now sending what they call liberator squads across the country to ensure a smooth transition of power. I urge all Americans to cooperate with the German forces, said the President in a radio speech yesterday. Do not take up arms. Do not try to act out in any way against the orders of the German army. We do not want any more bloodshed. The atom bomb that devastated New York was a wake-up call for all of us. The war is over. Hmm. <laughs> Yes, but there are still resistance cells out there. Gold? Oh, is it like a thing for a horse? Something? Oh, it's the fucking uh, monowheel that we stole. Okay, cool. Nice. Alright, that's the barn. See, worth investigating to find all those little bits and bobs. God, it has such a Fallout vibe, doesn't it? I mean, look at it, like the trucks and things like that. Ooh, there's a fucking uh, map there. Hello, hello. 
pool. I saw that. That's good. We've got a pool back here. Right, we're not going to go up to the house because that's probably... Who wants to go next? There's another thing here and there's a marker over there. Let's go up to this one since it's close. Oh, it's like a little grave for a... Ah. Whose grave is this? for a dog, maybe, or... Yeah, it's for the dog, isn't it? You can see the dead dog there. This life is a hardship, Billy. It is long, and it is paved with heartbreak. You will be old. Before you reach Rod's end. Just remember, my boy. It will end better than it began. I see the black eye she's got there, yeah. I say they did a good job actually with the kid. To make him look like a much younger version of the actual Blaskovich. Mm. Let's see. Yes. I was wondering what the grave would be there. I mean, it seemed like very small. So I thought, yeah, maybe it's for an animal. <laughs> Alright, so, what's going to be over there then? I don't suppose there is anything else, though, around to find. Look at the scenery, though. Looks gorgeous, doesn't it? Yep. Yeah, we definitely can't go over there. That's the map boundary, probably. Alright, well, it looks like it wants us to go over here. And then it wants us to go to the house. Because obviously that objective marker was coming up there. Alright. See what we've got over here. The tree roots. I wonder what that was for a second then. Oh, cactus. What do we got here? Inspect the tree. Really? Yeah? Can I tell you a secret? Okay. So you can hear me gulping tea I down. To tell anyone. Yeah, okay. I'll whisper it. The first love. Who was there before Anya? I see. No oh boy. No oh, wow, you got that. Somewhere, somewhere, Billy. Inclined to this day to endure amongst the living. I don't know. I get a horrible feeling she may well be dead. I'm just going to say that right now. <laughs> oh, killed in a Nazi world. All right. Well, I guess we're going to the house then. Yeah, this place looks like it's seen better days, not gonna lie. Alright, well, something tells me it's, um, maybe we're not gonna find anyone in here. Who knows, we'll see. Hmm, it's freaking like, insects going everywhere, seem to go across the floor. Open front door, I guess. Mama! Daddy! What's the goddamn ruckus? <laughs> They, they pinned me down, they took my pocket knife! What the hell is wrong with you? You let them take your property, they're gonna walk all over you till there's nothing left. Now, I gave you that pocket knife, it was in your care, it's your responsibility. I will speak to their parents. You will do no such thing, Sophia. Oh, you gonna let your mommy fight your battles for you, are you, boy? Now you go on out there and take back what's yours, and you are not setting foot in this house again until you do. God damn, Dad. Dad. Daddy. <laughs> what an asshole. Could be a bit more supportive, couldn't you, old boy? Good lord. Alright. Oh gosh. Well, this place, it's a fixer-upper. Let's put it that way. What's this? 
Uh, Aunt Wilma's letter. Dearest Rip, I hope that you're holding up well and cooperating with our new administration. I must say, things are looking much brighter for us now. Your uncle has been promised a new job at the regime, a janitor at the new SS building in the city centre. He's very excited. It's a far cry from the machine operator job he used to have before he was fired all those years ago. But he puts bread on the table, so how's Sophia? Imagine that she's worried now, considering the circumstance. I hear the Germans have some issues with the Jews. I bet if she cooperates with them... Yeah, maybe, yeah, gas me tea. Yeah. I bet if she cooperates with them, everything will be okay. Oh dear. No, it's like, so Rip, yeah, Rip, Rip must be the father. Anyway, I hope we can visit you again this summer. Love, Aunt Wilma. Oh boy. Oh, I don't like where it's going. Star card. What have we got? 361, Lucy Cell. How you doing there, Lucy Cell? Nice, right. Oh, this place is a bit overgrown. God, it's such fucking Fallout vibes, though. That's what it gives me. Right, something on the floor. Uber com uh, Commandant uh, Wex Wexler. That's how we pronounce it. Um, date, May 1st, 49. Herr Rip Blazkowicz. Thank you for expressing your willingness to cooperate with us. The more information you provide us with, Jews and Deviants, their location and so forth, the more rewards you will get for showing your loyalty. There may even be a chance to get a new place for you. In the future, I suspect there will be many vacant mansions that need to be occupied by those who are loyal to the Reich. I will look into these Frank and Archibald characters that were troubling you. Looking forward to hearing from you again, Herr Blaskovich. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> he sold them out. <laughs> oh dear. Ooh boy. Right. Let's keep moving, though, and seeing what the deal is. I wonder if it probably wants us to go upstairs last. Let's have a look. Oh, star card. Oh, he's in the drawer. There it was. 177, Hector Silva. He's looking a snazzy guy. Look at him. I say look at him as I immediately then quit out. <laughs> what do we got? Uh, another newspaper one. Fragment of old news article. The larger the mob, the harder the test. In small areas before, car uh, before small electorates, a first-rate man occasionally fights his way through carrying even the mob with him by force of his personality. When the field is nationwide, and the fight must be waged chiefly at second and third hand, and the force of personality cannot so readily make itself felt, then all the odds are on the man who is, intrinsically, the most devious and mediocre. The man who can most easily adapt, uh, adeptly disperse the notion that his mind is a virtual vacuum. Oh God. <coughs> Cough. Whew. Right, the presidency tends year by year to go to such men. As democracy is perfected, the office represents more and more closely the inner soul of the people. We move toward a lofty ideal. On some great and glorious day, the plain folks of the land will reach their heart's desire at last, and the White House will be adorned by a downright moron. Damn. What's going on in that one? Good lord. Back door. Switches. Ah, the hallway. And then we've got, presumably, a little storage closet to the basement. Oh god. Do we want to go upstairs or do we want to go to the basement first? Let's go to the basement first. Mm. Okay. Well, no doubt it's going to be something in here that we're going to have to... I'll be in the grave rotting away. And still a better daddy than you. Yeah, you probably got some unresolved issues, haven't you? Blazkowicz. Ah, Starcard. There we go. And a lot of them here. 19, Sebastian Dunn. Giving a very thoughtful Rodan-esque pose there. Was it Rodan who did the thinker? I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. Yes, this looks familiar, doesn't it? Deary me, well, there's more stuff over here. What's that? Gold. What did I get there? Ah, it's you two. I see. It's like a... Oh, it's a post box. That's what it is. Mailbox, even, since we're in America. Uh, young Billy's note. Paper is bloodstained and wrinkled. I swear I'll be a good boy. I swear I'll not disobey my father. I swear I'll clean up my room. I swear I'll clean up the dishes. I swear I'll act like a goddamn man. I swear I'll not disgrace my people. This text was written by an adult. Billy Blazkowicz. The name was written by a child. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, well, there's a freaking upgrade kit over here that we can take. Oh, thank God that old Daddy Blazkowicz, for all his flaws, left this behind for us. What uh, upgrades can we get for the shock hammer? Rotor. Rotor upgrade rapidly loads all three barrels of the shock hammer, allowing you to fire three shells at once for maximum damage output. Ooh. Pretty good. Proceed to toggle this upgrade for a weapon equipped in right hand, Z for equipped in left hand. Okay, I'll have to try and remember that. Ah, it looks like you do get the ricochet one. Shrapnel pieces uh, ricochet when hit, hitting a hard surface, causing additional damage. That's basically the bouncing bullets, isn't it, from New Order? Yeah, I used to love that upgrade. It was a good one. Maybe I'll get that one. Extended magazine doubles up shot camera magazine capacity. Also a good one that we can work towards. Let's get the ricochet, because I like it. Boom. That'll be a great one, that will. Good. See? Always worth exploring. Never know what you might find. 
Right, well, I guess we go up um, upstairs now, don't we? All right, where are we? In here? Nothing in the kind of floor in the main hallway? No, not by the looks of it. Up we go. Where's Billy's room? Oh, there's a room there. Stuff down the hallway. I assume probably... Ah, objective marker came up over there, so that's probably where we need to go last, isn't it? Is there any actual bathroom in this place, or do they have an outhouse? Presumably an outhouse, actually. 116, Marty Lean. Cool. Jazzy. Right. Yeah, I would actually, now that I think about it, probably, for these kind of old houses, they'd probably have, like, an outhouse, rather than an indoor bathroom. Uh, 490, Larry Johnson. Okay. Got those big headphones on there. You know, speaking of outhouses, right, and outdoor sort of toilets, my uh, mother... She actually remembers, as a child back in the 60s, going uh, to her her, um, her grandmother, who lived at a cottage in the countryside. This was obviously here in the UK. You know, they didn't have, like, a proper bathroom. They had literally an outdoor toilet. So, yeah, wasn't that long ago here in the UK. It was only, what, 60s? As recently as that. Inspect BB pellets. What have we got? Yeah. Hey. Son, I have tried reasoning with you. I've tried smacking sense into you till the cows come home and nothing is working. Every night you wake me up with these noises. No matter how many times I try to tell you there are no monsters in our basement. I'm sorry, Daddy. At night, I see them. Clear as daylight. They're coming to kill Mama. All right. Here's what we're going to do. You take this. Wow. Now, you and I are going down into the basement. And any monsters that show up, we shoot them dead. Right between their eyes. Sometimes the best way to fix a problem is to face it head on. You with uh. me? Yes, Daddy. Sophia! You in on this? You see them? No, Daddy. The monsters are gone. Well, I reckon if you do no wrong, ain't no monster gonna come after you, son. You think we scared them off for good this time? May I keep the gun? God, you sleep with that thing right there, do you? It'll be interesting to see the father if he explores his character more and more. You see, that shot there, you know, what you have to remember, of course, is this is the 1920s the flashbacks are going to. And so, of course, this was a time when, you know, child psychology and things like that was <laughs> barely a fucking science. People didn't really know how to handle that kind of thing. Open bedroom door to exit level. Okay, so we don't want to go in there, basically. That doesn't mean, of course, the father isn't without flaws. The father has a lot of fucking flaws. But, we have to remember is that a lot of people in this kind of time did. That's not to excuse any of the things they did at all. But it'll be interesting, you know, for the game to kind of show perhaps other sides to the father as well. Like it did just then, kind of. Where it showed that actually, in a sort of sense, he can be kind of caring when uh, push comes to shove. He just has a very bad way of going about doing it, sort of, if that makes sense. Like, he's trying to go for a more nuanced picture of the father than just a straightforward, oh, he's an abusive asshole kind of thing. He's trying to explore the character. What's in here? This must be the parents' room. the ring. Place is gone to shit. Oh, hello. I ain't been down here in nary a decade. I own a 2,000 acre ranch up by Forney Lake now. I heard on the radio you'd been sighted up near Roswell. I figured you might show up here. 
Nothing in this house but bad memories. So why'd you come? You need a place to hide? You need money? Well, you're barking up the wrong tree, son. Far too late to come begging now. Ain't nothing you can offer to make up for what you've done to us. I think of my father, I see a fuck you and a fist flying in my face. When'd you ever do right by me? Disobedient, ungrateful, sense like a flat tire, and a mouth like a sewer. Oh, I saw where you was headed. I've been down that hole myself. And I guarantee goddamn to you, I did all in my might to pull you out. What's your backstory? What more do you want from me? Hmm. He said something interesting there. I want you to treat me like I matter. Like I wasn't some piece of dog shit got stuck on your shoe. I did my damnedest with you. The truth is you were broke beyond fixing. What, are you some sort of super killer terror bomber now? You're on the wrong side, buddy. All them years, I was banging my head into the wall. Coming to see that everyone was against me. And when the Nazis took over, things got a lot better. I imagine they did for you. You play by their rules. You can do very well for yourself. Yeah, it's maybe a bit late for that now. <laughs> anyone around these parts, Blaskowitz is a name of renown and respect. Everything you touch turns to shit, and I do not need your stink on my name. Wanted murderer. Run off to the army as soon as you come of age. You broke your mother's heart. Where is she? I'm feeling, yeah. Is she dead? When? What happened? happened is we had a big goddamn war and now we got a new government with new rules mm -hmm. they took her she gone and what's that queer outfit you're wearing what do you mean they took her they rounded up all the jews and the coloreds and the queers this is a white man's world now white man's got to keep it christian you sold her out. So what? Wife made a living bemoaning me and raised a boy into a murderer. Well, I always saw you for what you are. Ten pounds of shit in a five pound bag. I don't think that's going to work. He's got armor on. <laughs> Down on your fucking knees. Okay, well that might do a bit more damage. Was the time I was scared of you. Was the time I'd have pissed myself, had a gun pointed at my head. You know what I feel right now? Not a goddamn thing. Oh, there we go. Shit, we're gonna. Ooh. God damn. I heard everything. He called the Nazis. Who in the hell did you call? Who do you think, Blaskovich? He fucking sold out. I think maybe it's time to get out of here. No! Oh, 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 what is that? Shit me. Oh, fucking. Goddamn. I disable these claws. Uh, I just tried to. God. Gap, come on, melee. Oh, it's a fucking outsmart, sir. Is it the fucking flying fortress? Holy shit. What the hell just happened? Did they, they fucking pick up the house? Oh my god, they did. Oh god, drones. Shit. Get out of here. I knew it. I don't think so. I don't think so at all. I'm going this way, you motherfuckers. 
Here he gets. All right, let me just get the old laser boy out. All right, what's the ideal way here? Ah, up here, I'm guessing. Well, this is not what I expected. It's just the father did say something kind of interesting then. I've been down that route myself or something. Something like that is what he said. Oh, God. Fuck. Get a better weapon. Quick. This one. Shit. Fuck. Yeah, get out of here. Good Lord. Get out of it. I'm missing every shot there. Never mind. <laughs> Damn, this is how you do it. Right, they're out. Right, we're off. Ooh. Son of a bitch, do you drop any uh, armour, actually, for me to pick up? Yeah, he dropped a bit of metal. Yeah, that's good. Ah, I should probably be using the shot camera, shouldn't I? I have a feeling that's what it wants. Are we just going to disable the fucking claws whilst we're in the air up here? Is that what it wants us to do? Right, go on. Right, I am seriously fucking hitting the middle mouse button so many times, it's not doing anything. Oh, this don't feel good. This feels like a fucking Alice in Wonderland ride from hell, this does. On a freaking flying house. There's one more claw over there. Oh god. Get out of here. You're down. Oh god. Bad boys. Go on, stay down, bitches! Fucking bar stewards. Good lord. Fuck all of them. Please keep moving. Shit. Fuck you. Keep those robots out of here. Right, go downstairs. Keep the ammo. There we go, that's it. Anything in here? Health, yes, that's good. Right, fucking smash it. This feels dangerous, but... We're out. Why did I come here? I should have run home. To you, Anya. Damn. What a fucking sequence. Okay. That looks like it hurt. Well, hopefully they don't pick you up whilst you're unconscious there. Of course they do. Your arm is smashed now. when we were going to see you again. It'd been a while. Do you want to love and cherish me till death do us part? <laughs> Come here. Would you like to kiss the bride now? But not before the wedding. Shake much love. It was. This don't feel good. I need you to rest now. Ooh, got straight to the neck, jeez. While I prepare the ceremony. Well, don't feel good at all. Here don't feel good at all. Oh god. Wasn't that lovely? Well, just parade him in public. There you go. And I'm the guy wearing the black hat. No, 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 I, no! I say you will not deny me access to my client. Special. Real. I am entitled to confer with my client in absolute privacy. I don't know if that's going to wash here. You will be looking for another job tomorrow. You hear me? Now you let me see my client, or you're going to test me. Okay. Yeah, especially. <laughs> You're actually gonna play the lawyer game. 
thing covering his mouth. Not my problem, it stays on. Oh, Christ. Will you just give us some privacy, please? Oh, you look like ass, man. Fuck. <laughs> Looks we like could you're see you too. Door. Seriously, this is not a good look for you. Anyway, listen, uh, your trial's coming up in a couple of weeks, and after that, they're going to execute you, and that whole charade is going to be televised to every living room on the planet. So instead of that bullshit going down, we're going to break you the fuck out of here right now. It's kind of a risky plan, but the security they have around you is out of this world, so it's kind of the only play we got. All right? I mean, the hoops. I had to jump through to get to you, and I'm your fucking lawyer. That pissed me off. But anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make like you attacked me, and when the guard pig comes in looking for your ass, I'm gonna sneak up behind him, and I'm gonna shove this little number right into the base of his skull. I'm gonna grab his keys and his gun, and I'm gonna roll you right on out to the elevator. <laughs> Pop and Nazis, wherever they show up, straight down the garage, where boom, body and Anya and everyone else has to get away. Maybe you should just not say it out loud. I feel like this room's probably booked. Let's get this freak show on the road. Maybe we should just get on with it. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Don't faint on me. So bad. You don't even know. Could you not maybe have fucking gagged on you? All right. Once we hit the street, it's all car chases and flying bullets. They got tanks outside, man. We got some tricks up our sleeve, though. I was gonna say we maybe you should have. Far. We make it. <laughs> Look at you. Could you not have freaking uh, don't hard released hard. me? He's getting down to the garage. Well, I suppose you need the keys, don't you? Hey! Help! Help! Open the door! He fucking attacked me, man! He broke my nose, and then he got out through that door right there! Fucking Terror Billy! He's on the loose! Stay back. And, and, he, and he had help. Uh, they, they came in right through that door, and they broke him out. Just get on with it, it man. Space aliens, man! <laughs> well, you took far too long. <laughs> it was a trick. <laughs> Cut! <laughs> so, my man, Sie haben Talent. Sie sollten zum Film gehen, bei Helene vorsprechen. Guter Schuss, General. Der zuckt noch. Well, he's not twitching now, I don't he think. Idiot. He was dead as soon as he walked into the building. Tapfer, kleiner Liebling. Ich bin dein und du bist mein. Who's the voice actress for Liebling, Engel? So lieblich und open your mouth. I feel like she does a pretty good job. Oh God, <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> Ugh, Jesus. That's it. Huh? How does it taste? Shh. How does it taste? The gunpowder of the bullet that killed your friend. How does it feel? Do you love the taste? Oh! <laughs> you hear that? It's my attack force. Mm. Moving in on your friends in the garage. You're so boy. I'm gonna go down there now and join in on the fun. Anya, my family. Yeah, stick the hood back on. Well, Spesh, you did a fucking good we job. <laughs> or more. Feel myself slipping away. Got me praying for the end. For theft and destruction of public and private property. Aiding the enemy. Torture. Terrorism, including nuclear, both domestic and abroad. And high treason. For gruesome murders that number in the thousands, you have been found guilty, Mr. William Joseph Blaskowitz. It is rare, even for a man of my job description, to come face to face with true evil. 
And it pains me that the maximum sentence that I can bestow upon you is something as trivial as death. Death, Mr. Blaskowitz. Nothing but swift, sheer death. Get on with it, Your Honor. <laughs> Bailiff. We know he's not going to die. He appears in young blood. Oh, I can free myself apparently, like this. Oh God, don't fail me now. Shoot the judge! Wow, suddenly they're not there anymore. Come here. Wow, that was easy, wasn't it? There we go. Judge is down. Sorry, Your Honour. I know there's kind of contempt of court, but uh, what can you do, eh? Oh God. Shit. Um, what the? Oh, I'm out of fucking ammo in that thing. Oh, I'm out of ammo in a lot of things, actually. <laughs> oh no, that's not good. Well, it looks like we're uh, at it. Oh, guns over here. Thank you very much. It's okay. Don't you worry, guys. Let me just uh, sort myself out with everything I need. What's that over here? Oh, that's better. That feels much, much better. Boom, armor. Thank you very much. Are you getting all this on television? You know? Oi, who's there? Come here, you motherfucker. Gonna get ya. Well, we got some good music, though, at least, to uh, accompany us on this kill, kill, killing spree. No! Oh, shit. Give me all your ammo. I still feel really satisfied that we took the judge out. <laughs> Changing positions? Well, so am I, believe it or not. Give me that. Come on. Can I... There we are. Who's there? Hey! There you are. Oh, shit. Carefully does it. Crap. Keep that overcharging on the health. It's probably here for the best. Oh, I see you up there, mate. Who's running around? There you are. There's probably a way out of here, and I'm just supposed to find it. Shit. That's a lot of stuff going down. Ah, wow, you were easy to take out. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, I got my shock hammer as well. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Get down. Where are they? He's up here somewhere. There he is. Or oh, one of them, at least. Got him. Oh, shit. Right, you know what? I think maybe we have to switch out to a slightly uh, more powerful weapon. Right. Oh, there we go. On this. I don't know what that sound is, but it's not good. Okay, it's probably going to be just a certain number of enemies I have to kill here. Okay, get out. Overcharge my health, baby. I'm going to take them all down. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Hold on. Please, um, wait up whilst I sort these motherfuckers out. He's down. Right. Ah. Oh, God. That's not good. I don't want to deal with that. If I can avoid it, shit. Fucking motherfuckers. No. Good thing. Shit. They're just destroying this courtroom. That's what they're doing. Come on. Danny, go. Shit. Get ya. That's it. I'm gonna get one of these now. I'm gonna fuck you all up. Shit. Who's shooting now? Shit! Oh, God. Oh, that's not good. Well, hopefully it might uh, actually save at that point there. Yep, it did. That's nice of them. Oh. Fuck you. Get them all. It's okay. I'm alright. Don't you worry. He's out. Not great, but he's now. Where's that Tutherin? Well, this didn't go well for any of you now, did it? The fact that I'm here destroying this courtroom. Oh, here they come. Right. Oh, shit. See you up there, mate. Shit, don't even try it. Run the gun. That's how it's done. In this game. Oh, God. Shit. Come on. Oh! I was not paying attention to my health again. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Gotta remember, manual saving is a thing in this game. Come on, then. Got him. Get all the ammo. Shit. Fuck. Get him down. That's it. Just gonna keep moving. Oof. 
Fucking take his leg out from underneath him. That's how you do it. Right, go, 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 go. Over here. Get the armour. That's what we need. Get all the armour. Oh, I've got this thing. Oh, this could be quite helpful, actually. I can actually hold E to detach this bad boy. Oh, here they come. Come on, them. And you. You're going down, bitch. And you. I want to get you. Yeah, blow him up. God, this is not doing... Oh, there we go. That feels... Oh, shit. Once again, not paying attention to health. Come on, Red. He's probably actually getting quite close behind me. That's the problem there. All right, we know what to do, though. Come on. Get out of it. Shit, he didn't die. Fuck. Shut up. Oh, God. Bad shit. Man, you survived some real good shotgun ammo blasting there, didn't you? And you. Get all the munitions that we can possibly get. Armour, whatever else we can find. Right. Get this thing ready. Ready on this bad boy. Wait for the other one to come down. There we go. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. With all guns. Barrels. Okay, time to move. Go. I should have picked it up. That's what I should have done. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, oh, oh. God, they do so much damage so quick. Don't they? Holy shit. Right, I'm behind here for a bit. Motherfuckers. Oh, there's armour there. I've got that. Shit. No, motherfucker. Don't try it. Right, he's down. He's down. I'll get one of his things, though. Shit. Come on. Stay down, bitch. Shit. He's out. And this one. Right, out of ammo. Dump it. Shit. Shit, there's so many of them. Oh, fuck. Fuck you. 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 Fuck, fuck him. Get him. That's it. Oh my god, I'm on one health. No. Oh, you son of a bitch. Fucking took me out then. No. Oh, and I'm back here now. Motherfuckers, this area's hard. Yeah, get down. And you. Get all the health. Give me this. Motherfucker, pick it up. That's what I want to do. Go on. Why am I shooting out here? I'm not even... Fuck you, you bastard. There we go. Get all the munitions like this. Get all the armour. All the stuff that we could possibly need. Get everything you can find. Gonna need it. Oh, here they come. Oh, there's gonna be one on this side who's gonna appear. Here he is. Right, he's down. We got him. Right, the other one's going to come. We just have to deal with them, that's all. Go on, then. Whoa, son of a bitch. Fuck you. Fuck, bad time to reload. Got him. There we go. Right, give me everything. Uh, fuck. Right, I'm going this way. Because I can. Oh! Motherfucking dogs. Oh, God, not you. Shit, bad time to reload. Fuck you. Fuck you, Fallout robots. Fuck. Fuck them all. Bad place to be. Shit. What's this thing? Oh, what the? Hey, did I just do that? And I just did something or other. Right, get this thing. What are you doing? Man, the weapons do feel good in this game, don't they? I'm getting on out of here. Shit, time to go. Ooh, fuck you. No, you don't. Oh, my God. Fucking Hitler? What the hell? Jesus. I'm pretty sure Hitler is in this game, if I'm not mistaken. Because I'm pretty sure I've seen... Oh, God. Bad, bad. Fuck. Q out of ammo. Shit. Throw it down, throw it down, throw it down. Come on. Oh, my God. What are you doing? What are you doing? Why are you switching weapons? That's not what I needed you to do. Son of a bitch. Oh, I better have fucking saved after that. Fuck me. This again? Come on, now. Why is it not... I should be using the manual save. That's what I should be doing. Right, get that. There we go. Round here. Shut up. I'm going to fucking mess you all up. Fuck all of you. Oi, you. Get him out. Oi, where are you going? Got him. God, he just fucking got eviscerated. He did. Good lord. Right. Check all ammo. It's all, all the stuff we need. Any health? Thank God. Uh-oh, here they come. Right. Back up over this way. I see you, mate. Don't even try it. 
Oh god, there he is. Right, he's out. Oh no, he's not out. Fuck, I hate it when they do that. But where's my weapon? What are you doing with that fucking thing? Get it out. There we go. God, I hate how it switches out like that. Where is he? He's there. Fuck you. Fuck you, bitch. Stay down. Right, I'm out of here. I'm out. Oh, here they come. God damn, gotta watch out. Oh, motherfuckers, they're so tough. Fuck them all. Get everything. Fuck, you're not moving fast enough, Billy. Fuck. Oh, I'm out. Shit. No. No, my God. Wow, they take you out so fast. Holy shit. I, okay, you know what? Maybe um, maybe the trick is not to... Go him. Right, switch out. Get where are you going? Oh, shit. That motherfucker's being a bitch. And you. Shit. Take him down. Get this thing. Where is it? Here it is. We use this to take out the big boys when they come in. Good lord, there's so many enemies in this location. They are horrid, aren't they? Come on. Oh god. They take a fair bit of punishment, these guys do. Oh god, what are you doing? Come on. Take him down. There we go, he's out. Right, get all the munitions and whatever else have you. Go, 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 go. Crap, he's over there. Oh, what the? Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Right, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Get all the snuff, go, 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 go. I'm out of here. Shit, I'm stuck. Motherfuckers. Right. Shit, I see you. Don't have grenades or anything. Shit, I'm out. Right, you. I'm out of here, gotta keep moving. That's what you gotta do, I think. Shit. I'm going. I'm not bothering with any of you, shit. Fuck you. Fuck all of ya. Get out of here. And you. Shit. Shit. Shit, motherfucker. Fucking shotgun, dude. Oh no, who's behind me? No. Nobody's behind me. I'm fine. Just the fucking robots, that's what it is. God dang, how many fucking enemies are there? Holy shit. So dang many of them. Where's my backup here? Fuck you. Oh, bad time to reload. Oh, I'm out of fucking ammo. Switch out. There we go. That's it. Where am I going? Where the fuck am I going? I don't actually know. Son of a bitch. Get him down. Oh my god. What am I stuck on? Where am I going? Where do I need to go here? Fuck me. Can you not give me a checkpoint after killing all those enemies and getting out of the room? There's so fucking many people to deal with here. Right, give me stuff. Fuck. Fuck, who's shooting me? Get out of there. Motherfucking assholes. Get out of it. Good lord, this area is quite uh, stressful. <laughs> Good lord. Alright, oh, just fucking health there. Overcharge me, baby. There we go. I fucking need it. Right. Here they come. Is it one of the big boys? I shouldn't waste ammo, actually, just yet. Right, get all the stuff. Oh god. That's not quite what I wanted to do, but never mind. Right, keep concentrating on him. Right, he's gonna come round. Shit. Oh, no, you don't. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Oh my god, the take off so much health so quickly! What the hell? Holy crap! I don't have grenades either, or anything. That is so ridiculous. Oh my god, I'm gonna die again. I'm actually, I'm straight up dead. Holy shit! There's so many enemies here! Holy moly! Right. That guy. Hit him. Are you dead? You better be. Fuck you. Switch out! Switch out! Please! For the love of God, switch out! Faster! You need to be way faster than you are! Good lord. Keep moving. Right, get this. Oh god, this thing has massive fucking bullets! Right now this motherfucker is over here! Who came from fucking nowhere! Good lord! Come on! Right, pick it up. There we go. Oh my god, how are you not dead already? Right, here they come. Right. They're coming for me. We'll take this one first. Concentrate our fire. That's it. Come on. Motherfuckers. Right, he's down. There we go. Right, come on. Get him. Right, he's down as well. I'm going this way. Got him. Right, get in here, get the armour, quickly. Get everything. 
Shit, fuck you. Fuck you. Doggo. God, take him out. Jesus. Oh, what? Just... Oh, come off it. What even was that? Oh my god, they take so many shots to kill as well. Such assholes, aren't they? Crap. You. Get down. Right, you know what? We need to fucking manual save. We fucking need it. Because holy shit. I'm amazed there's not like a checkpoint after you fucking murder a lot of these assholes. They are just fucking sending bombs off. Oh my god, they're just following me. I've just got a fucking posse coming after me here. Ridiculous. Right, one's down. Yeah, who does it? Fuck you, fuck you, robot. Robo dudes. Shit! Shit! Oh my god, I have no fucking armor! Where do I go here? Right, he's out. Just keep retreating. It's fine. Keep going up and round, and you'll be okay. In here, maybe. Uh, get all the ammunitions, get all the health, everything. I'm feeling a bit better now. Oh, fuck you. Oh, who's behind me now? Who are you? Where do you even come from? Oh my god, how many of you are there? I know this is like a really big fucking public area, but good lord. Oh, what now? Someone's down, but there he is. I see him. Fuck. It's bad. Gotta keep moving. That's all we gotta do. Shock ammo, ammo. Uh, let's go for this for a bit. Get in here. Get all the munitions. That's what we need. Max out health, max out armor, whatever we can get. Get this. Detach it. We need one of these bad boys. What's this over here? Armor. Give me all. Give me all of it. At least I got these stockpiles here like this. Where did the dude go? Oh, here he is. Fuck you. What is that fucking diesel go there you've got there? Feels like it, doesn't it? Oh shit, there's another one. It's a laser dude. There's another one. Stay down, bitch. Good lord. Oh my god. <laughs> that was so intense. <laughs> Ugh. What's this? Uh, diesel Gewehr? No, that's the laser one. I'm sure there was a guy here at a diesel... There it is. That's the fucking one. That's the one we want. Oh god, it's barely got anything. Well, never fucking mind. I don't want that one. Oh, shit. That's better. Alright. Okay. So now we can chill out just before we... Uh, actually make our escape here. Holy crap. Get all that. Uh, is there any armour, anything we take? Well, you know what? We're at full health here, so there's got to be a way out somewhere. Armour, thank you very much. Get all of it. Uh, this is where we need to go over here. Oh my god. That got crazy, that did, didn't it? Shit. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out. Oh, what's that, actually? Pistol ammo, I'll take it. Court has no exit level. This. You need to be careful. What? What? That was Mom. his mother. Yeah. Oh, my son. I thought I lost you, Mom. I don't know if this is the place for a reunion, but okay. Maybe you should get out of there. Oh, Billy. Life is full of unexpected things. Some make you cheerful, and some break your heart. I wasn't there when you needed me. I ran out on you. It hurt so much, Billy. It felt like my heart was being ripped out of my chest when you left. But all hardship is temporary. Do you know this? And most of it is inevitable. I had to stay behind so that you could leave. And now you're the one in trouble. Do not worry for me. My troubles are over, my son. I don't want to go back out there. But I can't do this anymore. You are strong, Billy. We are survivors, you and I. We keep fighting even when we do not know how. You cannot help but be my son. I'm having twins, Mama. 
they're not born yet. I want to see them. I wanted you to see them. I miss you. We will be together soon. You just have one more hardship to do. Oh, what? Balin. That was all fucking in my mind. Warm quill to daydreams. It's just Stolen. his fantasy, was it? A cold wind to reality. Well, I don't feel good. Oh. That's Washington. They replace Lincoln with bloody Hitler. I think they have. It's not going to go your way. We would have been so good together. Darling, you're breaking my heart. The old and the weak are doomed. Nah, they're gonna show up. <coughs> what? <coughs> uh, what? Well, that ended in an unexpected way. But something tells me... Well, damn! Wait, what? How? What? But that... What? What? Damn it, you made me go through that whole courthouse fight! It turned out it was all in his head? Or was it him? Everyone in position. She's dropping it. Really? You call that in a drone with a drone, rather? You're not seriously going to resurrect him, are you? Ready, Kinderlech? We have less than seven seconds. Okay. Ready, steady, Max Bombate. Grab it. Anya, now. Hurry. We have three seconds. We need to give his brain oxygenated blood or it will die. You gonna put him on a robot body? Oh, Jesus. Is he alive? Answer me, is he alive? Well, that got fucking intense. No, it's not. He comes back in young blood. What? Brain activity! Yes! He's alive! Oh. <laughs> fucking genius set that ever tell you that! He's on! Max is right. We should get out of here. The man ready for transport? Well, just put him in there, right? He is taught. Scheiße. It's <laughs> Well, I must say, it's took a turn I could never have expected. He's awake. Hey, look at that jammy bastard. The only person on the planet hard enough to survive getting his head chopped off. It's the Blazkowicz. Can you hear me? Uh-huh. Okay, so listen to this. <clears throat> Some time ago, Caroline obtained this latest generation biologically engineered super soldier body from a Nazi scientific Well, that's convenient. Lab. Very, very impressive specimen. Angela, please show this to him. Look, William. Seth is going to attach this to build a connection between your head and your new body. Oh, yeah. Don't you could technology? 
We're on the sub again. Oh god, it's that thing. Oh Jesus. Our fighters found in the field. None of them is working, but I have enough material to fix one contraption. You should decide which one you want. You can choose. Blink once for this one, blink twice for the one in the middle, blink three times for that over there. Um, <laughs> constrictor harness, ramshackles, battle walker. Oh god, do I have a, like a fallen choice? What's up what's with the battle walker? What's that about? Battle Walker, a mechan uh, mechanical actuator system that is mounted on your legs and activated on demand. Once activated, mechanical supports extend and allow you to access new areas, vertical covers, or the tactically advantageous positions. Double press jump button to activate. Oh god, so I have to make a choice. But at least I can inspect them. Ram shackles, metal reinforcement rig protecting your upper body joints, elbows and shoulders. Allows you to ram through obstacles, smash open doors, and create some pummel your enemies. Uh, ram shackles for active when you sprint. That could be a good one. Hmm, I like that. Constrictor harness. Um, constrictor harness will compress your torso and activation, allowing you to enter into narrow spaces. Oh my god. Using the harness prevents you from breathing properly. Prolonged use will cause damage and eventually death due to lack of oxygen. That doesn't sound good, not gonna lie. I kind of like the sound of the ramshackles, though, not gonna lie. Should we go with this one? Let's select the ramshackles. Sounds awesome. It automatically activates when sprinting as well. I mean, the Battle Walker sounds pretty good as well, but this one sounds like it would be pretty damn awesome. Just to smash into enemies, potentially. Does that, does that enable you to do that? Let's go with it. Okay, Yingle, let's get to work. I will sedate you now. See you soon. Well, damn. <laughs> oh, good lord. Well, you got your new body, though. That was ridiculously insane, that was. I thought they were just going to swoop in at last second and get him, but nope, they actually beheaded him. This fucking monkey cat. Good lord. What a strange creature. William. Is this real? Or am I in heaven? Set? Set! I'm awake, I'm not asleep, I'm God, and you got and you got and you got and you. How are you feeling, Mr. Blaskovich? Can you move your body? Yes, you can. Show us. Show us. I feel powerful. Do you remember your name? Do, do you remember your doings in the last two years? Aside from killing Nazis. <laughs> If you die one more time, William, I will murder you. <sighs> Come, I'll give you some clothes. Send them to me when you're done. Mm -hmm. uh, no, have you seen Ketzele? Where's to get Jane? Where's to get Jane? Shim Shim. I hear the Shim. Mr. Blaskovich. How I look? Like a new man, Yingle. A new man. Oh, and look at you. I'm so happy you're back. Now, this, same thing Shoshana has. There's no, 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 no. This connects your head to your body. Very, very important not to fiddle with this. Now, you might feel some weird tingling sensation, not to worry, it's normal. But let me know if anything else happens. For example, your head trying to reject your new body, something like this. It's hot! <laughs> Max! Max! Hot! Be careful, Max. <laughs> yeah, you are big, aren't you? Excellent. That gives you a sense of his uh, size. I have prepared the contraption you wanted. This thing, yes. Put it on. Well, we'll do that See what you can do with it. in the next episode, because we've been Go recording on, for a good while there. Put it on. Don't you worry, I'm just going to pause. Holy shit, that was an episode and a half, that was, wasn't it? Holy crap. I didn't even know what was going on there, but it seems we now have our super soldier body, which I'm assuming means we're going to have more health now. We're not going to be limited to 50, like we've been going through in the game so far, hopefully. But it also sounds like we're going to be really powerful. So, I'm going to see you in the next episode, where we'll put this thing on, and we'll get to work, hopefully. Oh, what the heck is happening there? 
Is that part of the game, or is that the game bugging out? I don't actually know. <laughs> All right, Facebook and Twitter links down below, along with a link to my propagandist channel for anyone interested. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and all that jazz. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody. Ah. Well, there's another one somewhere. I guess it's coming from this direction. Maybe. Ooh, where'd you even come from? Fuck. Fuck you. Fuck. I don't want to look at the gun, you idiot. Good lord. Ah, that's the, other, that's the beach from the other side. Okay, so there is more stuff over there. It's probably going to help, isn't it? Yeah, it looks ah, it? Oh, okay. That's that symbol. Maybe I should be writing these down. I feel like maybe I should be. Okay, or well, at least making a note of what these sheets of paper show. Let me just draw that. So it's two lines like that. It's got a line coming off to the right. Okay, I'm just going to.